because no matter what bug out put up, no matter what bug out lesson you see somebody put up, it's gonna be people in the comment board saying, "Oh, I'm so glad you you broke this down correctly. I'm so glad you did this. I'm so glad." Like it's still that woman, Royal Roots. Royal Roots, a fucking pastor, call herself a prophetess or a pastor, or whatever the fuck she call herself. She got 38,000 subscribers. Going off. She don't even supposed to be teaching. But everybody know the scriptures to a subscription they don't like. That's a lesson right there. <laughs> everybody know the scriptures to us one they don't like. <laughs> Shalom, shalom to the nation of Israel. Before we get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh, by Hashem, Rukahakwadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David. 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom, right? <laughs> so this your brother Shopper, man. So at camp yesterday, I was doing a camp, man, and I made a statement, and it kind of was sticking with me. Everybody know the scriptures until it's a scripture that they don't like, to it's a scripture that cut them. Matter of fact, we start here instead of starting there at Mark. We start right here. Until it's a scripture that go against what they doing, what they saying, what they thinking, what what how they feel. You know, really a big, I feel, I feel this, I feel that. Well, the scriptures don't say what you feel. <laughs> Hebrews chapter 4 and 12. For the, for the word of the Most High is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit and of the joints and marrow, and is a discerner of the thoughts, <laughs> and is a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. Yeah, the scriptures come out. The scriptures going to try what you think, what you feel, man. And then what you going to do? You going to still say, well, bump with the scriptures. See, I still feel like this. Well, you say we ain't saved until the end. No, I don't say, the, the scriptures say, he that endureth to the end, the same shall be saved. So you running around right now, and we not at the end yet, talking about you saved, that go against what the scriptures say. But you saved though. Mark chapter 7 and 6. He answered and said unto them, well, hath Elias, Isaiah, uh, 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 yeah, uh, Elias, Isaiah prophesied of you hypocrites, as it is written, this people honoreth me with their lips. This people honoreth me with their lips. But their heart is far from me. Howbeit in vain do they worship me, teaching for the doctrines, the commandments of men. Yeah. They, 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 their heart is far away from the scriptures, man. You a woman that's out there, call yourself teaching. Your, your heart what you feel, what you thinking, what you got going on is far removed from what the scriptures say. The scriptures say you shouldn't be teaching, man. A man that know the truth, but that's that's not out there teaching. That's not what the scriptures say. A man that, that know the truth should be doing. I'm watching a brother today, the, the um, oh, well, Christians or Edomites or heathens believe that it's we say by grace and anybody that believes. That's not what the scriptures say. It's not what, not what the scriptures say. The saints, the saints are the Israelites. They are the Israelites, plain and simple, man. Let's keep getting it. I don't want to make this too long. We ain't going to make this too long. Yeah, the, everybody like the scriptures to us, one that go against what they, what they doing. What they doing, what they saying, what they feeling, what they thinking. Hosea 8 and 1, set the trumpet to thy mouth. He, sh he shall come as an eagle against the house of the Lord, because they have transgressed my covenant and trans trespassed against my law. Israel shall cry unto me, my power we know thee. Yeah. 
Cause we we going off, man. We not we not doing what we supposed to be doing according to the scriptures, man. According to the scriptures, we not doing what we supposed to be doing. Ezekiel, Ezekiel, let's get this one. Ezekiel sixteen and fifty nine, I think it is. Maybe fifty eight. Ezekiel sixteen and fifty eight. Thou hast borne thy lewdness and thine abomination, saith the Lord. For thus saith the Lord power, I will even deal with thee as thou hast done, which has despised the oath in breaking the covenant. Yeah, we want to do whatever we want to do. <laughs> Not, we want to do whatever we want to do. This is what we, we want to be. We want to do whatever we want to do. We want, matter of fact, where's this one at right here? Israel want to do whatever they want to do and then think that the Lord going to accept it. They even the thing is I decided to turn back to Jesus. I decided to turn back to God. No, no, that's not how it works. You think the most high, you think your how and your how was shy is sitting back going, oh, I, I can't wait for such and such to turn back to me. I can't wait. I can't wait for this this individual. I can't wait for the brother down there shopper to decide that he want to follow me again. Man, get out of here. That sounds stupid. Romans 10 and 2. For I bear them record that they have a zeal of the Most High, but not according to knowledge. For they being ignorant of the Most High's righteousness and going about to establish their own righteousness, have not submitted themselves unto the righteousness of the Most High. Yeah. Establish their own righteousness. Women could teach. <laughs> Women pastors. <laughs> Women pastors, that really gets me. That really gets me. It, it's clear women shouldn't be teaching, man. It's very clear women shouldn't be teaching all over the scriptures. But, you know, again, they ain't listening to that. They ain't listening to that. The law clearly is not done away with. But they tell you, you can eat, you can eat pork. Even though it's in, it's in there that you shouldn't. Oh, well, you know, you... <laughs> Deuteronomy 29 and 24. Even all nations shall say, Wherefore hath the Lord done this, done thus unto this land? What meaneth the heat of his great anger? Then men shall say, Because they have forsaken the covenant. Then men shall say, because they have forsaken the covenant of the Lord power of their fathers, which he made with them when he brought them forth out of the land of Egypt. Yeah, we forsook the we the rules, the laws, the statutes, commandments, the customs that we were supposed to keep and pass down to our children from generation to generation. We threw them behind us, man. And so the Lord threw us behind. <laughs> to us behind him <laughs> the lord said you gonna chuck me away well i'm chucking y'all away too and that's why we how we at man let's go second chronicles 34 and 29 then the king sent and gathered together all the elders of judah and jerusalem going back to that covenant right and the king went up into the house of the lord and all the men of judah and the inhabitants of Jerusalem, and the priests, and the Levites, and all the people, great and small. And he read in their ears all the words of the book of the covenant that was found in the house of the Lord. And the king stood in his place and made a covenant before the Lord to walk after the Lord and keep his commandments and his testimonies and his statutes with all his heart and with all his soul to perform the words of the covenant which are written in this book. And we stopped doing it, man. <laughs> we stopped doing it. We stopped doing it, man. We stopped doing it, man. We stopped doing it and still not doing it. We still ain't doing it. We still not doing it. Everybody want to do their own thing, man. Want to do their own thing. And then you go out there, you cry loud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet and show thy people the house of Judah their sins. 
And people ain't trying to listen, man. Jeremiah 2 and 19. Thy own wickedness shall correct thee, and thy backsliding shall reprove thee. Know therefore and see that it is an evil thing and a bitter, that thou hast forsaken the Lord thy power, and that my fear is not in thee, saith the Lord, power of hosts. Yeah, man. This, this is this is this is where we at. Couple more, get a couple more. Got about about, about three more lined up, four more lined up. Let's get them. Let's see where we at on time. Oh yeah, we still good on time. Let's get it. Let's go right here, Ezekiel. Seven and eight. Let's get that one. Ezekiel seven and eight. Now. Will I shortly pour out my fury upon thee, and accomplish my anger upon thee, and I will judge thee according to thy ways, and will recompense thee for all thine abominations. Yeah. So all of the things that you won't don't want to do, that's going to distance, you gonna you gonna sooner or later you gonna have to answer for it, man. And my eye shall not spare, neither will I have pity. I will recompense thee according to thy ways and thine abominations that are in the midst of thee. And ye shall know that I am the Lord that smiteth. <laughs> Alright, we try to tell you, man. Behold a day. Behold, it is come. The morning is gone forth. The rod have blossomed. Pride have but budded. Violence is risen up unto a rod of wickedness. None of them shall remain, nor of their multitude, nor of any of theirs. Neither shall there be wailing for them. Neither shall there be wailing for them. Ain't gonna be no crying for, 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 for heads. Once it gets started, man. Why? Because we don't want to listen. Don't want to listen. Heads want to do what they want to do. You could do all kinds of lessons and this and this and that. The head, one of the Sakari heads down there, the brother Sakat, Sakat, I think it is, S-H-Q-A-T. The brother posted a um little clip of Sakari. Pretty much, they, um, Alizar done got all his men now talking shit about Paul out there, right? And so the one dude said, oh, stop scoffing. You won't go on Sakari comment board and say all that. What for? What? 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 Per, what? What will be gained by going on Sakari comment board? Any of the um Alizar, Deacon Hakar, and telling them they going off. Hey, all they gonna do is just go back hard. You want a debate? Hey, what the fuck is debate for? Keep going with that shit. Just keep going with that shit y'all doing, man. Keep going with that shit, man. Romans 2 and 5. But after thy hardness and impudent heart, treasureth up unto thyself wrath against the day of wrath and revelation of the righteous judgment of the Most High, who will render to every man according to his deeds. Yeah. yeah we, we, you do a lesson and that's it. 7. But unto them that are contentious, and do not obey the truth, but obey unrighteousness, indignation, and wrath. Yeah. Tribulation and anguish upon every soul of man that doeth evil. Of the Jew first and also of the Gentile. That's the Israelites in a Gentile state of mind. So they, oh, this is it right here, say the Gentiles. Shut up. Shut up. What is it, 1 Corinthians 12 or 2 Corinthians 12? Yeah, 1 Corinthians 12 and 1. Now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren, I would not have you ignorant. Ye know that ye were Gentiles carried away unto these dumb idols, even as ye were led. Yeah, Israelites are the Gentiles. In the Gentile state of mind, getting get just same thing like right here, going after the dumb shit that, that's going on here in Babylon. You could be anything in Babylon, and Jake is right along with being anything right here. You'll find an Israelite that's following any old thing. Islam, praying to the rock, uh, Buddhist, uh, Seventh-day Adventist, Christian, you, uh, Muslim, all that shit, man. All that shit. Kemet, Jake, and all that shit, man. 
Jake everything but an Israelite, man. You used to call him an Israelite it's like you spitting on him. Jeremiah 6 and 19. Hear, O earth, behold, I will bring evil upon this people. Who? The Lord's people. Even the fruit of their thoughts, because they have not hearkened unto my words, nor to my law, but rejected it. Huh? <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, Salaki. Yeah, yeah. Jeremiah 6 and 19. Hear, O earth, behold, I will bring evil upon this people, even the fruit of their thoughts, because they have not hearkened unto my words, nor to my law, but rejected it. Yeah. A woman shouldn't be teaching. Oh, well, I should, I should, men shouldn't be wearing a hat. Oh, I <laughs> Men don't supposed to shave off their beard. <laughs> Zachariah 7 and 10. Eleven. But they refused to hearken and pulled away the shoulder and stopped their ears that they should not hear. Yea, they made their hearts as an adamant stone. Least they should hear the law and the words, not just the law and the words. Oh, them is Paul's words right there. That, 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 you, you know, the Bible clearly tells when it's God speaking and when it's men speaking. And uh, 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 that's what the shit the Sakari nigga was saying. Yeah. And the words which the Lord of hosts have sent in his spirit by the form of prophets. Therefore came a great wrath from the Lord of hosts. Yeah, matter of fact, let's get this one. Is a second Peter or first Peter? Let's see if second Peter one might be here. Yeah, second Peter one and twenty. Knowing this first, that no prophecy of the scripture is of any private interpretation. For the prophecy came not in old time by the will of man, but holy men of the Most High spake as they were moved by the Rakakwadas, the Holy Spirit. So yeah, it, everything in the book, man, you spoke, it, it spoke, you spoke to adhere to the whole scripture, man. You don't supposed to take away or add. Has be taken away and adding all day, man. Taking away and adding all day. I'm about to get this last one. We gonna close out, man. So you you throwing away. Sakari ain't no better than that. Ch them chicks out there that call themselves reading the scriptures. Them them female pastors. They ain't no better than them. Same shit. Just a different damn different damn version of it. Ezekiel chapter thirty three and thirty one. And they thirty. Also, thou son of man, the children of thy people still are talking against thee by the walls and in the doors of the houses. They hate thee that rebuketh at the gate. And speak one to another, every one to his brother, saying, Come, I pray you, and hear, hear what is the word that cometh forth from the Lord. And they come unto thee as the people cometh, and they sit before thee as my people, and they hear thy words, but they will not do them. But they will not do them. For with their mouth they show much love, but their heart goeth after their covetousness. And lo, thou art unto them as a very lovely song, of one that have a pleasant voice and can play well on an instrument, for they hear thy words, but they do them not. And when this come, cometh to pass, lo, it will come. <laughs> it will come. Wait for it, though it tarry. It will not tarry. Lo, it will come. Then shall they know that a prophet have been among them. Yeah. So, yeah, this go back. This just... Hey, just want to do what they want to do, man. Everybody believe in the Bible till the Bible goes against what they feel and think. So with that one, we're going to close out. All praises, honor, glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shai. By Hashem, Rukha HaKadosh. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad. 
Unlike it to a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, remain spiritual out there. Shalom, Israel, to the next one. Shalom.